Hey people, Kate Slink here. How are we doing? So back into the world of DC Worlds Clyde. And I was kind of expecting this beta to kind of end tomorrow with it being March. I haven't seen a date yet when this beat is going to end, uh, but they've started a seven day event. So that tells me it's not going to end for, for at least another seven days. I, I, I don't know. It says March, so it could be any time. So let's enjoy the game while we can. So the event is for Raven. Now I haven't got Raven and um, she looks really cool to be fair. We've got this kind of picture event where you've got to kind of collect it's called the Vortex of Fate, and you've got to kind of collect these kind of diamond things. Um, and it's a bit like bingo, you get, if you can kind of get the diamonds in a row, you get that prize. One of them is the blueprint for Raven's Room, which is pretty cool. Um, lots of chance to get some diamonds, some encrypted tokens, and to get these, it's just kind of literally like playing the game. There's a daily one, which I've just got to finish off today, which I should be able to do. Um, that gets you the, the red kind of crystals, and then we've got the purple crystals, which are like uh, the whole week. Um, so like login, clear elseworld, three times, exchange gallery fragments one time. I've never done that before, so that's going to be uh, interesting how to do that. Um, hire guild mercenaries um, three times, should be easy enough to do, and obtain Raven herself. Um, now that would be the interesting one to get Raven. They have got a kind of like an banner at the moment, so you've got more chance of getting her. Again, you've got seven days. If we go to, is it recruited? There we go. So um, to get her, you've got, I think it's a thirty percent chance. It's a thirty percent chance of getting the following cre creature character when you obtain an epic character. So you've got thirty percent chance, which isn't a great chance, but it's better than the normal. I think is it free, epic character free. So, yeah, it 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 it's kind of uh, gives you more of a chance. So I, I'm gonna go over the next weekend now, a few days. A really crazy um, saving mode and try and get as much of these uh, diamonds as I can to get the forty to try and recruit her. I mean, if we get more, great. But um, who knows? The thirty percent chance might be in our favour. Now, Raven herself, like I said, I've got I had a chance to play. Um, if we go to the archive of her today, here we go. So she's one of the Teen Titans. Um, she's in fact the founding member of the Teen Titans. Um, the daughter of darkness fights for the world in which she fears she can never truly belong. Um, she's kind of a cool character. She's got some great skills. She's a um, support character in the intellect. I think it's right intellect. Um, some of her skills, she's got Devil Transformation, deals power damage equal to 306% of attack, power to enemy target, with the most debuffs. I've got a bit of gameplay that I'll show you in a minute, um, hover in action. Um, spiritual Radiation, so she attacks a target, dealing power damage equal to 85% of attack power, and ricochets one time. The ricochet damage is in decreased by 50%. Um, and it goes up in levels. We've got this great return to death, which makes a great support character that she revives. A defeated ally heals them from HP equal to 70% um, of Raven's current HP and it moves them into 50% progress of the action bar. And then after that, she's kind of like, can't do anything for a turn, but the more levels, she's got a bit more of a cooldown. It says there decreases to three rounds. It's pretty cool. It's a great skill to have, a great support. And then her kind of main one, the soul manipulation uh, upon dealing damage, randomly acts one stack of damage type debuff, bleed, poison, burn, or frostbite, and it lasts two rounds. It's a pretty cool kind of debuff character to uh, put some great uh, debuffs on. Um, and like I say, it's the kind of revive bit that really stood out for me. I think it's a great character to have in the gang. I think you're going to kind of, as much as a revive and she does a debuffs plus a damage, she kind of, you need someone still in the gang um, to kind of revive because she's going to need the health. The more health she's got, the better revive she's going to do. Um, so that's her in a nutshell. I'm sure there's a lot of people out there who've been playing this for a while that um, has this character. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Whereabouts in the game is she good? And is she good compared to her epic characters? I've still yet to find out. But in my eyes, because I'm new to the game, she is pretty decent. Um, bit of gameplay on her. So, if we have a look. This was kind of in the Elseworld. And this is what I love about the Elseworld. Is that you can kind of try characters that you haven't got yet. 
So you can see her there in the middle at the back. Um, she's going to be doing her skill now. This is the main one. So this is going to be doing the, the damage, the debuff damage. And then we're going to see, I think, the revive in action shortly. She kind of does hold her own as well, to be fair. Special radiation, there's a bit of a ricochet there, killed one. There's Bane, doing what Bane does best. And there we go, we've got Frankenstein, I think it's Frankenstein, that's died there, so now she should be able to do her revive from death, there it is, and bang. Unfortunately, she took some damage then, just before she did the revive, so he kind of only got like half, I think it was half health when he was revived, if not a bit less. So that's why I think with this character, you, you, you're going to need to uh, get someone that can keep her kind of topped up on health, because I think it will really help. And again, this is kind of another um, scenario I put her in. This time I've got the Green Lantern Flash, who is another amazing character. Um, there's some Frostbite she just put on. Do some damage. And she did all right, some damage there to uh, young Red Robin, I think his name is. Um, I think we're going to have another revive in this one. Not too sure if we lose someone. Special Radiation. I mean, that was great. Look at that ricochet. That ricochet was like, that was crazy. That did damage to everyone killed one of the enemy and did some crazy damage. So she is a great damage dealer as well as support. Like I said, I don't think she's going to be the best damage dealer in the game from other characters I've seen, but she surely can uh, do some all right damage. So Raven, that just, Superman just took that, well, the bad Superman, whatever his name is, um, just took that kind of on the chest and didn't do much damage. Um... We go now. I think he's nearly dead. I'm going to finish off. Flash is going to do some damage there. Bane again. He's tough. There we go. There's the life. Um, and because he had, she had better health that time, so she was able to give a bit more health. So that's definitely the key to her. You've got, you've really got to uh, make sure that she's got some decent health in her, and the rest is just history. There we go. And overall, the stats, she did some great damage. She did most damage out of everyone there, to be fair. So she is great for that. So, yeah, that's really all. Like I said, it was new to me. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of it. Is there any places she's good at? Um, I think she's a great character for an epic. I'm really looking forward to getting her myself. I hope I can get her next week. Like I said, 30% chance to get her. So I'm really hoping to. Um, and in the meantime, we'll do some of this Vortex of Fate. I don't know if this is kind of a an event that's similar to other events. Again, I'm very new to the game, so again, let me know in the comments below if you've been playing this for a bit. Is the other events similar to this, or did they change your events? So I kind of hope they do, but it's a pretty cool event, which is for playing the game. So there we go. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please let me know in the comments below, and also don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button on your way out. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>